This is Apollo, and my friend here. We're gonna uh, d take my Xbox out and destroy it. Some of you may have seen, depending on what form you looked at, that I have had one red ring, and just recently got the full red rings, as you can see. Uh, my graphics card's done. Motherboard's fried. Sound chip's about the only thing left, and it's not even working so well. So we're gonna go out back and completely annihilate this thing. See you in a few minutes. Yeah. Alright, what's up? Got the Xbox outside now. It's gonna be destroyed in a couple minutes. Uh, I'd like you to read this little note I wrote on the side, especially with the website. And uh, we're about to have some fun with this thing. Thanks, Microsoft. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, first, we're gonna start off with a little Sparta kick. Oh my! I'm grabbing some other stuff and rethinking our plan, which wasn't too safe to begin with, but now we're safer. We have goggles and. All the appropriate stuff for all you freaking safety nerds out there. Um, so here comes my friend. He's going to pull a Barney Rebel. A Bam Bam. Here it goes. Oh. Yes. <laughs> yes. All right, after a short break, grabbing our pizza, we're going to see what that thing did to it because it looked like it messed it up pretty bad. All right. Well, after I took a bat to it, I knocked the whole face plate off of it. As you can see, and wrecked the USB port yeah, to the right. Wrecked. Took off the side completely. There's some cracks in it right now in the front end, right there in the back. And as you said, the USB and the side. hard drive just all messed up. So that's what a wooden baseball bat will do to an Xbox. Next, we're gonna find something else to destroy at, likely a BB gun. Well, after the encounter with the bat, we decided we're gonna try to shoot it with a BB gun or two. Dude, you hit it. Well, for all the internal problems these things have, BB gun's not gonna cut it. I shot it, I pumped it for like five minutes, it did absolutely nothing. These things outsides are better made than the inside. Alright, the BB gun didn't work. Let's try a hammer. Wow, I think it worked. Geez, you have to hit it a little harder than that. Put some power into it. There you go. Yeah, well, for as hard as I hit it, it just dented it a little bit. There's a little hole in it. Nothing really. We're going to try hitting it from the other side because this looks like to be the back of it with all the metal parts in it. So we're going to try something else. All right, so that little hammer didn't do anything. We're going to just try with the all-out mini sledgehammer. Here we go. Uh, it went far, but I didn't see anything fly, so we're gonna check that out and maybe do a re-up, do over. Alright, well for me, swinging only half strength, so I didn't want to lose the hammer. Um, as you can see, from the front, we put that huge gash in it right there. And if you turn it around, it's starting to like split open almost. You could probably pull it apart if you wanted to, but that's too easy, so we're just gonna hit it a few more times. It's time for a crowbar! Come on, hit it! Hit it some more! Gamer's gone wild! Alright, well, as you can see, I just completely annihilated the back. And then, uh, I kind of took, dented it a bit, took a bit off. Um, as you can see, that I just found out, it's completely encased in metal. Like, there's a metal casing. And if you look really closely under it, you can see that we pushed a bit of plastic through the metal. So, um... Yeah, we're gonna find I'll a hole. Plug it in and start it up. <laughs> yeah, this might be a bit dangerous. Crowbar, weapon of choice. <laughs> Definitely. Your Xbox. That's Definitely. Start it off, actually. Definitely. All right. Well, we kind of just took the cover off. Well, actually, kind of fell off when we picked it up. So, um, yeah, we're gonna show you how strong this casing is. That we just found out how strong it is. So, if you wanna point the camera down? No, so there's like no really anything done except a few dents. There's Nothing a couple dents broken. that fell, that happened when it fell. So I'm just gonna nail it with this crowbar once or twice. Huh. Yeah, it did nice. absolutely nothing. Right. As you can see, there's kind of a few dents as he's adding more, but it's pretty much. starting to hurt my hand. Yeah, it's hurting his hand, so it's pretty strong. These definitely weren't made for this, but they were. 
weren't also supposed to break either, so I mean things change. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, we got kind of bored, we went inside and found some fireworks out of my basement. This is basically a mini rim candle. Um, it strobes light, shoots stuff up in the air, makes a lot of noise. Uh, we're gonna put a couple in the box, light them off, and see what happens. Uh, I have a couple in there already. We're just gonna have this one spare in case something wrong happens. I don't know what could, but yeah, it's gonna be fun. Let's launch it. Don't do it without a hose, kids. Go. What the hell? We're gonna run because it's kind of loud. Kind of bright, huh? No. There's your bottle of water. In the thing. Do you see it all? Okay. That's probably good. Okay. Okay. Alright, well, we realized that we probably should have had more water than a couple button a couple pitchers, so we grabbed some bottles too. It's starting to catch fire it looked like, but it's okay now. Uh we completely melted the inside. Uh we'll bring the camera over. Or we'll find some way to show you. So uh, you wanna turn it off. Alright well with little help from my friend, we're propping it open for you to see. And it's like completely it completely melted uh whatever piece of plastic that is in there. There are a bunch of wires like melted all over the place. It's good old fashioned fun. Don't do it at home. It's cool. It's cool. You'll get in trouble. Don't do it. Um, the crowbar is freezing. The crowbar is cold, I guess. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, we had water standing by, so don't do it without a hose, at least. And that's. <laughs> Alright, well, we just made another discovery as we were prying apart the top so you can see inside. We completely demolished the front of this Xbox. Like, the drive's the only thing left. The USB ports are gone. There's that little chip with a nice Microsoft logo on it still, but that's about it. So uh, we're gonna take it apart, show you the inside, and find out something else to do with it. Okay, well, there's the destroyed Xbox, and we kind of ran out of things to do, so we're gonna light another firework in it, but this time we have, you know, some water. Purified Giant Eagle brand. It's new, new, new Eco Light bottle. So it's pretty good, good water. So we're gonna use that just in case something catches fire. And then we're gonna find something else to do with it. So yeah, enjoy. Oh damn. It's a little bit bright there. Alright, so as he warms up, uh, we just look for more things to do. Uh, we found a couple. Uh, he's just going to bash it with a sledge again, just for nothing. No reason at all. There's no reason not to, so he's going to do it. Uh, whenever you're ready, bud. As you can see, little pieces of plastic flying out of it. Alright. <laughs> Alright, you can stop and we'll, we'll bring it over and show you what happened. Ah, well, it looks bad, but that's mainly from the firework stuff. All I really did was dent a little bit right here and right here. So, I guess that's the main hard drive or something. I don't know. Anyway, it's starting to be dented a little bit. Yep, we'll find something else to do. Hopefully an axe. Yeah, hopefully. 